I know there's a degree of, of alertness right now within the community, rightfully so, especially for young mothers who want to get pregnant or those who are pregnant. And as a practicing uh, high-risk specialist in the field of obstetrics, I get these questions every single day. And my answer is one has to use common judgment and you know, uh, universal precaution. If you're pregnant, clearly you want to be away from areas which is, uh, has a tremendous amount of uh, the Zika infection going, for example, in the Caribbean, Puerto Rico, South America, Brazil, etc. And if you do have to go there, my recommendation is, uh, you know, use, stay in a cold area, long sleeves, you can use the mosquito repellent, because I think the fear is constantly going to be there. In fact, even patients in New Jersey are constantly coming to us, doctor, I'm pregnant. Can I go out by the pool? What do I do? Am I going to get a Zika infection? And the answer is most likely not, because we don't have a lot of cases within the United States. All of the cases that have been reported are cases really where mothers have been infected outside the United States. But I think the lesson learned today is how crucial it is for us as physicians, as a community, as a medical organization, uh, at state level, federal level, for us to do every single thing possible to bring a halt of this epidemic, especially it reaching the United States. Because to me, it's quite frankly catastrophic for a young, healthy patient who is seeking to get pregnant or is pregnant to encounter this. So this is a time for us to get together, unite, and do every single thing possible to combat this condition.